April 2, 2014, around 16 days after lateral ear rejection surgery. The stitches have been removed yesterday and the horizontal canal can be seen clearly now. The vertical canal, the wall, the lateral wall have been removed. You can see the the hole, the hole is where the horizontal canal opening is. This is the right ear, now we turn to the left. We turn to the left side. Yeah, we turn, uh, just turn, turn this side. And, uh, okay, that's good. So we face, we face, yeah. I think you have to go that side. No, you have to go the, in front of the dog, yeah. Okay, positioning. Okay, the head up again. We just see the the canal again. Lift up the ear a bit. See the horizontal canal and the cartilage. There's the cartilage and the horizontal canal is the hole there, the black. It looks a bit of a black hole. Now lift up the ear vertically, the ear flat. Uh, you can see the cartilage, the drainage, drainage board is uh, below and the sutures have been removed two days ago so far so good the dog is uh, has a bit of shaking of the head but uh, not as bad as before and overall the body odor is, is no more there but we have to wait and see okay let go first close uh, let go of the dog you see the the ears are the ears are uh, sort of a uh, flop down but uh, there should be no problem now for ventilation and drainage. Okay, lift up the right ear again. Is there any pain? Touch the ear, any pain? Then the other ear. Press, press, no, just press it. Yeah. There seems to be no pain but uh, we don't know yet. Okay, I'm going down. Then walk, walk and see. Okay, walk. Ah, then walk, walk, walk to the front. He might. Normally, dogs should be exercised uh, twice a day. Let's bring for a walk. Uh. April 2, 2014, 6.30.